Blessed Valana de Body. Blessed Valana de Body, born in Florence, Italy, in 1332, lived a remarkable life that combined deep spirituality, commitment to her family, and a strong desire to serve God. Her life unfolded during a tumultuous period marked by political upheaval, religious fervor, and the devastating Black Death. Valana was born into a noble family, her father being a knight named Andrew de Body. From an early age, she exhibited a profound religious inclination and a desire for a life dedicated to God. She was drawn to the teachings of the Dominican friar, Giovanni Dominici, who emphasized the importance of repentance, humility, and devotion to God. At the age of 17, Bellana was married to Rosso di Piero. Her marriage was not without its challenges, as Rosso was known for his fiery temper and a worldly lifestyle. Despite the difficulties, Bellana approached her marital duties with grace and commitment, endeavoring to convert her husband to a more pious way of life. The couple had three children, and Bellana faced the trials of motherhood with fortitude. Her devotion to her family did not detract from her spiritual pursuits. Instead, she saw her role as a wife and mother as a means of fulfilling her duty to God. Bellana's household became a haven for those seeking spiritual guidance, as she opened her home to religious discussions and prayer. Tragedy struck Valana's life when the Black Death swept through Europe in the mid-14th century. The pandemic claimed the lives of two of Valana's children and left her grief-stricken. This profound loss, however, deepened her spirituality and led her to reevaluate the purpose of her life. Valana found solace and strength in her faith, dedicating herself even more fervently to a life of prayer and penance. She became associated with the Dominican order and embraced a form of lay spirituality that allowed her to integrate her religious devotion into her daily life. Bellana's home became a center for religious gatherings and discussions, attracting not only the local community, but also religious leaders seeking her counsel. Her reputation for holiness and wisdom spread, and Bellana became known for her mystical experiences, including visions and ecstasies. In these moments of divine connection, she claimed to receive messages and insights that guided her spiritual journey. Bellana's mystical experiences were both a source of inspiration and scrutiny, as some questioned the authenticity of her encounters with the divine. Despite the challenges she faced, Bellana continued to reach out to her husband, seeking his conversion. Rosso eventually underwent a profound spiritual transformation, renouncing his previous ways and joining Bellana in her pursuit of a devout life. The couple, once torn by worldly concerns, found unity in their shared commitment to God. Bellana de Body's life became a testament to the transformative power of faith and the redemptive nature of love. Her story illustrates the possibility of spiritual growth and conversion, even in the face of personal tragedy and worldly distractions. Bellana's influence extended beyond her immediate circle, impacting the broader community and earning her a reputation as a beacon of holiness. In recognition of her exemplary life, Bellana was beatified by the Catholic Church. Her beatification acknowledged her virtues, her perseverance in the face of adversity, and her unwavering commitment to a life of piety. The story of Blessed Valana de Body serves as an inspiration for those navigating the complexities of life, reminding them of the transformative power of faith, love, and a steadfast commitment to God.